obviously there was disappointment last weekend with the defeat to Sutton. What does Steve do? Does he does he go back over it? Does he say we put it to we put it to bed and we go again? What's the what's the kind of approach after a game like that? Yeah, of course we have to look at what went wrong um, because it's always about improving. And if we can look to improve and be better than we were in the previous game, and and we start to see improvements, you know, in training and in the following matches, and of course you're on, you're onto something. Um, but in this period, of, especially now, uh, the position we're in and with eight games left, we can't dwell on it too much. So we have a look at um, what went wrong, what we could do better and what we need to tighten up on. Um, but then, yes, it's back out on the training on the training field and working on the next game and whoever we've got and preparing in the right way. Yeah, and you kind of treating, I guess, each game as a, as a completely separate project. You go out there and, and tackle it in its own way. Yeah, of course. Look, we uh, we just lost to Sutton, uh, to Sutton, but before that we beat Bradford, you know. So um, I think that shows you that uh, any team we play faces, you know, you have a different uh, challenge, and each team that we have left to face and that we faced are, are beatable teams, um, and I'm sure they'll be saying the same about us. And that's what the sport is. So you know, we've got to prepare take each game as it comes and prepare individually for each one, not dwell on a past result or get too excited off of off of a good one. Yeah, it has been a strange season as well in League Two. You know, just as you think you've got a kind of a pattern, you can see the sides that are, are moving away, then they go and lose against one of the sides that you don't think they will lead to. So it, it seems that everybody is beatable right across from top to bottom. Yeah, exactly. And that's the, that's the beauty of the game. Um, and when, when you've got a league like that and, you know, the bottom teams can beat the top teams, I think that makes it more competitive and um, more fun to, to be involved in. And you are, you know, despite that disappointment of defeat, you know, you've got 10 points from your last possible 18. You are in a decent run of form. Yeah, we are. And I think we have to look at um, the amount of points we picked up in this short period, um, especially if you look at the whole season. Um, and we kind of, although we lost to Sutton in a what we definitely would have called a big game. Um, every game's a big game now, but what we would have called a big game, um, we can't be too too disheartened by that and um, kind of just reflect on the past few weeks and see that we've done some good work, picked up some important points and look forward to the remaining eight. Yeah. Um, Don't cast to themselves, of course, we're, we're, we're winning last weekend uh, at Swindon. Um, they look like they're going to be another one of those physical sides who are prepared to shoot from from range as well. You guys could, might have a busy old afternoon in defence. Yeah, well, we hope that uh, their defence is just as busy as ours, <laughs> if anything. So, um, yeah, as I say, we, you know, we look at them, of course, do our analysis, um, and just prepare in the right way and try to um, just be fully prepared to come come 3 p.m. on Saturday. What are you expecting from them, Doc? Um, well, you, you you would have seen them this season. Um, so as you say, they've got some um, good individual qualities, um, and they're they're a team that are doing all right and picked up some good results uh, recently as well. Um, but then again, so have we. So uh, it's going to be a good game. And playing on a hybrid pitch is that something you look forward to? Uh, yeah, I, I've, we saw in the analysis we managed to see, uh, to see their pitch. And it looks pretty decent, especially to some that we've played uh, played on recently. So it'll be nice to play on a on a smooth turf, and hopefully we can get some soccer going.